YouTube. What it do, what it do, my people. Welcome to the world of the Corsair Kings. I'm your host with the most, your player partner, PJ. Man, I know it's been a long time. I shouldn't have left you without a do. Nah, but, uh, hey, man, but I'm back, man. Don't worry, man. I ain't gone. I know a lot of y'all was like, man, put out new video, P. Put out all these deals. Put out new video, P. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to both of y'all that, that, you know what I'm saying, worried about me, wonder why I ain't put out no video, but I'm back, baby. Uh, before the video ever gets started, man, if you're not subscribed, go on, hit the subscribe button. It's somewhere around there, you know what I'm saying? Quick tap, and you locked in. Go on, like this video. Why not? Comment on this video. Say something nice to your boy. And follow me on Instagram, at Kings. Same as the channel. You already know what it is. Oh, oh, this? You? Oh, this thing? Oh, that's just a Corsair King logo rag. Yeah, that's it. Oh, you t this one? <laughs> oh, that's just that red thing, that silky, ilky, you feel me? You know. Oh, yeah. It's my, uh, it's my co host, Earl. You know what I'm saying? He rocking that black one, you feel me? Hey. You know what I'm saying? Got my rag. CourseHairKings.com. That's where you can check that out. And yeah, yeah, check me out, man. CourseHairKings.com. And I also, I also, I know a lot of y'all been waiting on these. Finally got them together. Finally ready to go. If you follow me on Instagram, you probably already know. Bars. Accident. Flow. All right. Who we got? We got Courshead King patches, baby. You know what I'm saying? With the silky, the silky back. You feel me? The silky. <laughs> go crazy, go crazy. CourseHeadKings.com, man. Check me out. I also have a couple t-shirts on there. This one not on there. I don't know why I showed y'all this one. This is just a personal one I did. But I do have a white and a black. You know, just a basic logo T on there, man. Check me out. Go support your boy, man. I really appreciate it. Appreciate all y'all. But in this video, in this video, what we doing? We are, well, I am answering some frequently asked questions that I get in my DMs on Instagram. The reason I'm doing this, because I get a lot of DMs. And I try my best to answer every single one of them, but it get kind of hard to keep up with. I ain't gonna lie to you, man. I'm approaching 8,500 over there. And uh, you know, Answering DMs is, is, is a struggle, man. So to kind of speed things up, I would like, well, not to speed things up, but kind of make it easier for me and you. If you ask me a question that I cover in this video, I'm just going to send you the link to this video, so, which is probably why you're here right now. You feel me? But I'm going to cover a couple topics. I got them written down in my notebook. You know what I'm saying? And uh, we're going to go over that. And also, I ain't forget about the giveaway, the ghost bar. I ain't forget about the, go the ghost bar giveaway. You know what I'm saying? I got the ghost bar. We gonna, I still got the wavy department rag I'm throwing in there. And guess what? Since I waited, made y'all wait so long, what I'm going to do is I'm going to throw a rag in there. I don't know what color. You choose your color. Red, white. I'm a boy Earl. Got the black. You know what I'm saying? You choose your color. And I'm going to throw in a whole three pack of the patches that's the giveaway man we doing the giveaway like that just because this is a been gone for too long giveaway you feel me so man when i get back from gotta gotta do the intro i know you missed the intro man of course head king so we're gonna uh do that come back from that and then i am gonna pick the winner right away bam and then we're gonna get into these frequently asked questions baby man you know what i'm saying so Stick around, man. We'll be back. Welcome, welcome to the world of the Corsair King. Yeah, 
we just some Corsair King Corsairs. Now welcome to the world of the Corsair King. The Corsair King. Hey, we the Corsair King. Okay, okay, folks. I am back. And are y'all ready? Let me, let me, hold on. Let me get this random generator popping. Let me get it, make sure it's right. All right, as you see right there, I am gonna generate this three times. And that third number is gonna be the winner. Names of the numbers written down right here, you know what I'm saying? Cause I am very, very professional. Sticky notes, you feel me? Let's get this started. All right, all right, all right, are you ready? So, we're gonna generate one time. And like I said, on the third time, that is the winning number. Third time. All right. So number one, bam, 1,385. Don't even matter. Number two, 690. Here we go. The winner is 894. So, think I got a winner. 894. And it goes to Jalen Rankins. Hey, congratulations, man. So you won a Ghost Bar three pack of crown patches. Any do-rag you want. This one, red, white, black. And you know what I'm saying? Um, and it was one, oh, and a wavy department do-rag. So that's four items, man. Congratulations, Jalen Rankins. All right, let's go and get into these frequently asked questions. I have them written down in no specific order. I wanna do about 10 questions in this one. I might have a part two with more questions. As they come, if I, I, I keep getting repetitive questions, I will do these videos more often, just so we can have a, a, a place with answers and with things that y'all can just come watch and you won't even have to ask me. Not that I don't like that when people ask me, man, I love helping y'all. I love helping the wave community, man. It went, the little knowledge that I do have, all my experimentation is for not only me, it is for my fellow wave. I try to, you know, I just want to spread love, positivity, help, motivate, you know, all that goodness. All right, all right. So let's get this started, man. Question number one, most asked question right here. I just started, any tips? That's it, that's the end of the question. Any tips? You know what my answer to that is? And you're gonna hate it. Brush your hair, man. Be on it. Stay consistent with brushing your hair. Moisturize your hair. Try it. If, if you really just started, you might be using unnatural products right now, which is fine. But as you, you know what I'm saying, get well into that ripple stage, transition to some all natural stuff. You know, like some, like I love, you know I love this. If you know me, you know I love my grapeseed oil. You know I love my jojoba oil. I'm an oil, I'm an oil fiend. Wavy department oil. And shout out to my H-Time partner, man. Shout out to my boy, J. Lou. Got that Texas T, man, H-Time for real. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Just get you some natural product. Got some natural light. Shout out to my boy, Drip Set. The moan, you feel me, you know what I'm saying? Me so wavy. Got the natural light and you already know. Don't even need no label. You know that's that Sugar Shane secret sauce right there. So these are just some products that I use. You know, you don't even have to go hard on the, on the expensive brushes. You know, I got, well, I don't use these anymore, but this is what I started with. My Diane, Curved Little Diane's. Uh, how many rolls is that? There's seven rolls. You know what I'm saying? This is what I started with right here. And they got me that, so I recommend these brushes for a beginner. I recommend some of, some products similar to these, or if you can get your hands on grapeseed oil, go for it. Always use a mirror when you're brushing, especially at the beginning. You know, keep your hair healthy, keep your hair clean, rag up at night, all the typical stuff. Number one is brush though, so brush. Number two, this ain't even a question. Sometimes I check my DMs and like a good 10% of them are just a picture. Like it's just a picture. Like no questions, no nothing. Don't do that. 
if you want an uh, actual reply from me. If you just want me to like that picture, then hey, that's all that's gonna happen. Because if I just, you send me a picture, either I might comment and be like, hey, you look good, or I might just double tap, like it, you know, I don't know what to say to that. But that's number two, man. If, if like, if you just gonna send me a picture, I suggest you put like a question or a caption or something, say something to me, man. You know what I'm saying? Don't be shy, you feel me? Number three, I get the picture. Show me the crown and you know you got the, the line going through that thing. And the question is, hey, how do I get rid of this? So, so if you got that line right here, going straight across, that is because you're brushing like this, like this. You know what I'm saying? You're just creating a part. You're just brushing sort of op opposite way. So, you know, I have a beehive crown and I ain't really gonna show it to you right now. I will post my crown videos up there and you know what I'm saying, you follow those videos. So, that's my answer for that. If you wanna get rid of that line, watch this video or this video, wherever it shows up, I forget every time I record. Go watch that. Hey, and you got it. There you go. Get your crown right. That was number three right there, you know what I'm saying? How to maintain your wolf. Really, man, I kinda answered that in question. Nah, I didn't answer that, but maintain your wolf, man. Brush, again, comb, hard brush, hard brush, hard brush medium brush, soft brush, plastic bag, do-rag, double compress, lay that thing down, uh, thing down, do that, stay consistent, stay on top of your wolf, don't let your wolf run you, run that wolf, you feel me, you know what I'm saying, you gotta work that thing, the wolf is, it's not easy, but it is very doable, you should not be over curling after about two, three weeks of wolfing, if you are, you're not taking care of your hair. You're wetting your hair in the shower for no reason. As a coarse hair waver, low porosity, I wet my hair in the shower, my hair will curl up, stick up, and I will have to fight for it to lay down. So unless I'm washing it, as you know from my first ever video I posted here, I do not wet my hair in the shower. Don't wet your hair in the shower, especially when wolfing, or you're gonna have a bad time. Bam. And another video. Watch how I do my brush session. I got a video where I brush my wolf from a fro to lay using only wavy department oil. And bam, just like that, man. That's how I maintain my wolf, and that is how you can do yours. That was number four, right? Yes, sir. Number five, how do I develop my sides? I'm gonna just point to the video over here. Gotcha. I did a video on that already, too. Just go to it. Bam, hit your angles right. All right, number six. What are your angles? I don't think I've quite done an angle video. I have done videos where I'm brushing my hair and I show my angles on there, even though I have tightened up my angles, man. I have really tightened up my angles because I have flow issues everywhere and I saw that I was hitting certain spots, overlapping all that stuff and I really cut down on it. I cut down on the overlapping. I cut down on the like sloppy brush and I really got my brush game together. You don't believe me? You want me to? Nah. But you know what I'm saying? So um, I will make a very detailed video on my angle soon. But for now, let me just get y'all example off the rip. Oh, oh. So my angle, you see me? Bam, bam, you know what I'm saying? That's that's my like first angle I always hit. From basically from the crown to the temple. That's my, that's my, my number one angle. Then I move up a little bit and I turn the brush a little bit. So I'm going almost straight right there. As you can see, bam, up top, bam. One in the middle, one on this side, and I repeat. So if my first angle was right here, my second angle right here, and another one in the middle. And I repeat that on both sides. So pointing with my finger. First angle, bam, bam, 
Bam. 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 And I will go into more details on that later. So that's basic angles, PJs, angles, one-on-one. Number seven, how, I get this one a lot too. I get this one a lot. How do you get your hair to be so shiny? Hey, not gonna lie to you. Great seed oil. This gets my hair shiny. Also keeping my hair clean. Keeping my hair well maintained. That's what we gotta do. We are coarse hair wavers, man. Number one rule is to keep your hair healthy because that's when our hair looks the best. We don't have bad hair. We have hair that's not taken care of properly. Therefore, it looks like we got them nappy things. But if you take care of your hair, man, you're gonna see that shine. It's gonna be laid, and you know what I'm saying? You're gonna be like, ooh, that boy, that. You know what I'm saying? So I showed you the product, man. It's just a mixture of all this stuff. Like you can try, just try different things out. Try different things out and see what works for you and what gives your hair that shine. And there's a lot of products on the market that can give your hair shine. But number one, just keep your hair healthy. And I'm an oil person, so I love oil. So that was number seven. We gonna move on to number eight. How do you get rid of forks? The way I get rid of forks, which I've gotten rid of a lot of forks, even though you might see a lot of forks in my head right now. But you know what I'm saying? That is a fraction of what I had a few months ago. You feel me? I've been breaking them, boy. But the way I get rid of forks, comb. Comb like crazy. Love the comb. Combing really helps stretch your waves, all that stuff, and it helps break forks. Hard brush. A lot of vertical brushing, you know, you know vertical brushing is like this instead of like this. You know what I'm saying? You really want to work those spots with the forks. And a good wolf, and also a really good way to break forks, man. When you um, have a low cut, when you get to that like 1.5, hey, work that first week after you cut down to like one open or 1.5, Go hard, just medium brush. You don't have to go no harder than that on a low cut. But man, work that low cut. I'm telling you, you can make a lot of progress within that first week if you put the work in. Also, you know what I'm saying? You just get some overwatch bars and do your overwatch. That'll break forks. There's a lot of ways to break forks. Try them out. Try them all out, man. I mean, you can be breaking forks back, back to back, you feel me? Another question I always have. Um, you know how I don't I don't have a lot of money to spend. How can I wave on a budget? How can I be a waiver on a budget? Easiest thing, man. I just showed y'all my my OG brushes. You know what I'm saying? These are my original brushes that I use. My these brushes were like four or five dollars at the um. But it's my dog brush now. But these brushes were like four or five dollars at the um beauty supply. Go to the beauty supply, your local beauty supply, man. You can get red by kids do rags, which I really recommend for any beginner. Anybody who doesn't want to spend a lot of money, red by kids do rags range from about two, three dollars to about five dollars. Any anywhere in that range, man. I found them for two dollars at certain stores. But man, they're good rags, man. I, I like I, I mess with red by kids rags. You know what I'm saying? Get you products that don't have to be expensive. You don't have to go get products with a big name on them and like man grapeseed oil this is this is like a seven eight dollar bottle and this thing is huge man like i've been using this for a long time and a lot like so if when you break it down i mean seven eight dollars like this is well over a year worth of oil in here so man you that's not that much at all that is that is cheap man get you some um when I first started, I used uh, Shea Moisture um, leave-in conditioner, the um, black Jamaican oil. That was about $10 for the thing, man. Big old tub. It lasts for a long time. I mean, don't be put off by something being $10 when you get in a large amount of it because you got to realize you're only using about a dime size maybe if you really need it like three or four times a week. 
because you shouldn't have to put it in every day. Some people do, but even if you're using it every day, I mean, dime size, nickel size, it's still gonna last a long time. So you're gonna probably buy that product once, and then by the time you need to buy it again, man, you'll have money saved up to buy more. So don't think you gotta go out here and spend a lot of money. Even on my combs, I use carbon fiber combs. And when I tell you that's still cheap, bro, they're like $4 at the beauty supply. Everything, just go to the beauty supply, read the ingredients, try to stay all natural, man. And, and it's, not, it's not expensive to wave. If you wanna spend money on waving, it's because you want to. I, I I don't really know how to say that any. Like, you only spend a lot of money because you choose to, because you don't have to, you feel me? But that's as far as I'm going. I know I went a little long on that question, but I really, like, that's a passionate question. Okay, we are at the 10th and final question. All right, and this one is, how long did it take you to get waves? Simple question, honestly. I had a ball fade, not really no waves on the top in November of 2019. We're now in September of 2020. I say my hair grew in, got the taper in December. So about nine months, nine months and I'm here. So, you know, don't think you're gonna get waves, I mean, like this tomorrow. It's gonna take time, it takes time. It is a lifestyle. It is something you have to stick to. If you think, that is just gonna be a quick thing, you might not wanna get in a wave, man, cause it's really a process, man. So, yeah, about nine months, man, and that's about it for the question, frequently asked questions. Might do a part two. If you have more questions that you want me to answer, comment them in the comment section down below. Visit CourseHairKings.com. You know what I'm saying? Forgot the winner's name already. Oh, Jalen Rankins, about to hit you up. Congratulations. Like this video. Subscribe to my channel. Thank y'all for sticking with me. I know I need to be more consistent and I am. Got a new setup right now. Well, I'm just in a new spot. Next video, I might go back over there by the mirror, but you know, your boy got the bright lights and everything. You know what I'm saying? Feeling good. You know what I'm saying? Once again, I'm gonna plug myself again. CourseHairKings.com, baby. You know what I'm saying? Check me out. I appreciate y'all support. Follow me on Instagram at Course Hair King. The same as the channel. And man, I'm out. I don't know how y'all can y'all see these these waters right now though. Can can y'all can you see? Can you see a crowd? Can, let me know. Let me know how I'm looking, man. I don't know quite know if y'all can see that clearly. But your boy, your boy been putting in work, man. But yeah, thank you for tuning in. Appreciate y'all for everything, man. Until next time, gang, gang. <laughs>